Damn. I have to put it in 2K though. Hang on a sec so you guys can actually see it. Taito Ecology on Steam is the name of this game. I just can't get it to fit right now. Maybe, oh. All right, that's as close as it's going to get. Yes, I have Xander, and that's what uh, this reminded me of. Oh, do you really battle? The god of catching? Yo, battle. That's exactly what you are. I don't know if you heard me, but I was like, you were blowing my mind with the catches. I know, this is a chill stream tonight. Oh, I meant to put Chill Town in my title, but I didn't do it. Put it in 4K? I'm not going to put it in 4K, Weeha. The name of my profile is The Oman TV. And the icon? We're going to do a Kitty Cat. Of course. Do they have a sloth? No. They just have Kitty Cats. Maybe they have a sloth. No, we're just gonna go kitty cat. All right, the old man TV. It's a kitty cat. Let me uh, let me move myself. Boom, boom. Uh, overlay cam. Drag myself down here. There we go. Eight hours ago. I don't know if I want to, man. That was so hard. I haven't seen him forever either, Xander. Do the rat horse thing? No, we I don't know what a rat horse thing is. That was fun though, battle. I had a good time, man. Tutorial on? Yeah, we can we can do the tutorial. What kind of biome do we want to build? A grassland? A rainforest? Or a desert? What do you guys think? I'm thinking grassland. Grassland seems like it might be the easiest. All right, sounds good, Weeha. Cooking time? What are you making, you sir? It's cooking time. Follow me, yeah, because I'm going straight to the top. Yo, battle. Thanks for the follow, man. Welcome, welcome. Why is that so tiny? I can't even read what it says. It was really fun playing with you, man. Have a good night. Sleep well. Hit you up on Steam. Yo, sounds good, dude. All right, I'm going. I'm going grassland. Let's create the biome. Taito Ecology, build your biome. Hi, I'm Albot. Welcome to Taito Ecology. Here you can grow and maintain your very own ecosystem. This is your biodome. I wonder if it comes with Poly Shore. I bet it doesn't. It looks pretty empty now, but don't worry. It'll be home to all sorts of plants and animals soon. Let's take a look around. Catch you later. Oh, you freaking jabroni. All right. <laughs> That's good. Use W, A, S, and D keys to move around and rotate the owl bot. Hold shift down to move quickly. Try flying for a little while. Okay. When you're ready to move on, press continue. Adding life. Chicken, veggies, and rice? Dude, that sounds wonderful. You're able to add many cool animals and plants to your biodome. You'll be able to unlock and learn about all these species over time. Let's try placing down your first consumer. A consumer is an organism that gets its energy by eating plants or animals. Use your impact points to place a consumer in your biodome. So my impact points regenerate over time. Those are up here. Open the life. I don't know who that was. I like, I like legit don't know who that is. Zima? Hi to you too, Zima. And he's gone. Oh, it probably is Prudhomme. Alright. 
So I, I forgot that I was in gaming room five, so someone named Zima just hopped in and said hi or something. Hi Zima. Okay. I'm back in my live uh channel now. Was that you, Fuzzy Pink? I your name in Discord was Zima, you pleb. I don't know who Zima is. He's a man of many names. All right, let's, we're going to the life. Oh wait, I gotta move myself then because you guys can't see that now. Uh, edit scene, edit donger, edit life. Boom, boom. We're gonna go like right there. Oh, he said, why? Damn it. All right, we're, this is, uh, we're gonna purchase a prairie dog with impact points. So prairie dogs cost 35 impact points. They are a small herbivore. Click on the terrain to place the territory. Oh, snap. There's our prairie dog. You place your first consumer territory. Animals will only move around within their territory. Try viewing territory information by clicking on the territory marker. I have... I don't even know what to say to you right now, Fuzzy Pink. Are these... These things are just making babies like crazy. What's the territory marker? Oh, let's see its info. So they're hungry. They're just cranking out babies. They're hungry. Click on prairie dog moving around to see it's it's hungry. Okay, the hunger bar is low. That means they need food. Try placing down some producers. Producers such as plants make their own energy from the sun. It may be helpful to see more of your surroundings when placing life. Enter strategic view by scrolling out. Oh. Oh, here we go. Plants. Three blue grandma grass groups. What? Oh, here we go. Blue grandma grass. One. Two. Hey, gardening is fun. There should be a lot of grass in the grassland. Let's get those rewards, baby. Two. Three. There we go. We've got some grass for our little baby. Should. All right, your prairie dog should have be much less hungry now. See if their hunger has improved. Yo, 100%. Our little pleb dogs are happy. Average hunger, 99%. Will overpopulate soon without anything controlling their growth. You need a predator. Predators are animals that eat other animals. Unlock a new predator species by using Taito coins you just earned from your achievement. Okay, so there's our Taito coins. We gotta select the consumer. And we're gonna... Oh, we have to get the red fox. It's forcing us to unlock the red fox. Unlock. Place a red fox territory. Okie dokie. So if I put a red fox like over here, it's going to interact with the prairie dog and the grass. There we go. Awesome. With a predator around, prey animals won't overpopulate your ecosystem. A great job. A prairie dog is not a rat horse, you jabroni. Now that you have a few inhabitants in your biodome, be careful about... Detritus. 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 Detritus.
Thank you, Spot. I agree. Be careful about detritus. Detritus is another word for waste, such as dead leaves, bones, and poop. Allowing too much detritus to build up will harm everything in your ecosystem. This is where decomposers come in. Decomposers break down detritus into nutrients that can be used again by producers. This keeps the cycle of life going. Let's add some now. Uh, place a mushroom near the prairie dogs. Um, de Ooh. Right there's good. Decomposer. I'm de de decomposing. Yo, Gfro, good morning, man. Gfro, I want you to talk to my buddy GTX Monster. He is, as we speak, playing Rune Scrapple. Just a heads up. All right, your decomposers will consume some detritus every day, but only from the plants and animals within its territory. If your biodome starts creating more detritus than your decomposers can handle, you'll need to add more decomposers. Shut up, Xander. <laughs> Congrats. You now understand the basics of maintaining an ecosystem with all three elements. Producers, consumers, and DDD composers. We got it. Speed up your ecosystem time by pressing this button. Pause. Average health of everything in your biodome. Name your biodome. Weeha. Take a picture of your ecosystem at any time using photo view. All photos will be saved to the library folder. Scroll up all the way in the camera view. Circle of life. Where is this? I'm trying to scroll. Oh, there's camera view. Let's begin. Keep building your own ecosystem. The choice is yours. Okay, well, I want to start a new one now that... Let's start a new one. That's the tutorial. We're going to delete Weeha. Sorry, Weeha. We're going to make a new grassland. Shit, did I, do... did I leave the tutorial on again? I don't want the tutorial. Mistakes, main menu. We're going to delete this one, confirm. And tutorial off, create biodome. Ba bam Let's give it a name, the Oman TV. Shit, I made a desert. Why can't I do this correctly? I just can't do anything right. Delete biodome, confirm. Add new biodome, grassland, tutorial off, create biodome. I think we got it. I think we got it. All right, what games have I played today? Uh, Cap, how do you pronounce it? Kappa Tino or something? Kappa? Cop Copa Nito All Stars Soccer? Uh, Robot Roller Derby Disco Dodgeball? And now this biodome, biodome game. Yo, that's what I've been doing every Saturday for the past 40 weeks, Jim. Episode 40 of Spontaneous Saturday. Rainforest would be cooler? Alright, shit. Let's just do a rainforest then. You're right. It would be cooler. I think you're right. We gotta save the rainforest. Tutorial off. Create biodome. Let's go, baby. Like, Jim, it started off slow. You know what I mean? Because... Like, everyone knew me from my other games, but, like, eventually, Spontaneous Saturdays, like, became a thing. They're fun. I like them. Just because I like taking a break and playing weird-ass games. Like this. Alright, so my biodome health is at zero. Let's, uh... Ants? M moths? Ocelots? Armadillos? All right, let's start off with some, um, some agouti. Let's get some agouti up in this place, you know what I'm saying? The agouti. 
are a small herbivore. They're just gonna chill nearby the river. That's actually, that's that's why I like I liked them right there. The agouti, everybody. The agouti are gonna eat uh, ferns that we're gonna place also around the river. Yo, Green Thumb Rainforest, let's go. Gardening is fun. I agree. Get rewards. Thank you. Thank you. Look at the booty on that agouti. I know, right? Let's look at him. Detritus level one. Occupancy, we're doing okay. We got to get something to break down the detritus. So let's get some freaking earthworms up in this. We just bought ourselves some earthworms. Earthworms are going to get rid of all detritus. And they've got such a wide range. Boom, baby. Earthworms saving the freaking planet. One earthworm at a time. Let's go. And uh, we got to unlock the ocelot. And we got place the ocelot over here just to take care of the agouti. Uh, I know, Mr. Piggles, it's because this game doesn't exist on Twitch, dude. To take care of the agouti pop population, we gotta get some ocelots. Oh my god, look at the ocelot! They're so beautiful. The agoutis are doing wonderfully. Look at the ocelot. Yo, is an ocelot about to kill an agouti? I think they're about to interact. I think they're about to go crazy. No, 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 no. They're just friends right now. They're friends. Yeah, it's Taito Biodome. My bad, dude. Agouti looks nothing like a, a horse, yo. How are you guys doing? Great. How are you doing? Fantastic. Okay. I don't have enough points to, like, do anything else. So I could add some ants. Like, I can't unlock anything right now. So I'm going to add some ants. Just to mess with everything. Like, that's really going to mess with everything. But, like, I'm going to mess with the ants by putting them on island. Yo, Devo, what's up, bro? Sounds good, man. I'm going to put the ants on island. Just to screw with the ants. Like, if the ants want to, they can cross the water. But they're going to have to... They're, it's It's going to be at their own risk. Everything is sleeping right now. We got our earthworms. Hopefully the ants don't kill the earthworms. Earthworms are looking beautiful. Uh, ocelots looking amazing. Oh, sh I, I forgot to start time. The agoutis are, are Gucci. And the ant population is high. I'm going to need some pollination soon. So let's drop some moths up in this moth. You know what I mean? Moths can interact with any thong. All right? Yo, Weeha, have a good night, dude. I'll talk to you next time. You had legs at the gym? g -fro, I love leg day, bro. Consumer's paradise. We did it. Get our rewards. Ship it. All right, we need some more plants. Let's get the heliconia plant. The heliconia plant looks dope. We're going to place those near the moths. The moths. There we go. Give the moths something to do. You know what I'm saying? 
Papaya acai. Amazon flame tree. A cape oak tree. A keep oak tree. Some pineapple. Oh, dope. Right now we just have leaves. I want to get an armadillo up in here. But uh, it's going to take some time, I think. We've only been live for two days. Oh, look at this. Agoutis are herbivores. They primarily eat fruits. It tells you everything about all of the stuff. That's crazy. This is like, this is a learning game, y'all. Shut up, Xander. That's not a plant. It doesn't exist. I have papaya. Oh my god. You guys are the worst. Yo, Devo. Dear Mr. The O-Man, haha, <laughs> here you go. Y'all, check it out later, man. Thank you, Devo, for the one, two, three. <laughs> Thanks for the one, two, three, man. What can I do here? Purchase impact points. Wait, oh, okay. How do I earn these then? You know what I mean? Why is my biodome in... Oh. My agoutis are hungry, yo. That's not good. And my ocelots are hungry too. That None of this is going well. Okay, uh... Let's get, I guess, maybe some more plants? Some more heliconias? Let's put them down. Maybe some more ferns? No, no, the heliconias look better. There we go, their hunger, their hunger is getting better. Everyone's hunger is getting better now. I just need more plants. There we go, dope. I think you guys don't have the right mindset. I think you guys are goofballs. But it's okay. Alexander the Great, 91, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Xander, thank you for the 4, 5, 6. Thank you, guys. <laughs> thank you, Xander. We are, uh, we're learning about biomes here. We're learning how to count over there in the middle. This general area, I believe, is where it pops up. What is this? Nothing. Okay. Why are we still at 99% health? Because they're hunger. Well, they need to just eat then. The freaking plebs. The agoutis. The weehaws. The agoutis are literally the weehaws of the world. You know what I mean? And the ocelots are still hungry too. They're going to reproduce soon though. Yo, I love... Why are you so... If you're so hungry, then eat. You little pleb. The heliconias are flowering. These are in stasis. The hell does that mean? They've got plenty of leaves. There's plenty of stuff for you guys to eat, yo. Hmm. Like, I'm afraid to put more more dudes down because it looks like they're hungry. Is this The Sims? Kind of hell, Yemen. It's, uh... It's, uh... It's Taito Biome. It's like, uh... It's like we're making a biodome. Except there's no Poly Shore. You know what I mean? Let's drop some more goodies in. This seems like a bad idea, but let's do it. We're going to have another agouti population right next door to the original agouti population. Uh, Mr. Pickles, I've played it before, man. You must have missed it. I've played it like three times before, Mr. Pickles. Alright, so we've got another group of agoutis. Joe! Thank you. I need more. 
Diversity score of a 4, average health 100. Diversity score plants is a 2, average health 98%. Well, that's not good. I need weak sauce. You survived a week, just 51 more of these, and you might have an achievement that's actually, that's actually impressive. Yo, the game is talking crap to me. Oh, they eat fruit? Oh, shoot. Okay. Well, uh... I don't have nearly enough points to unlock the Strangler Fig. I need points. Like, stat. I could un unlock the Armadillo who could eat the ants. But I'll wait. I need some fruit. Yeah, that's true, Mr. Piggles. Maybe not. It was- I had a lot of fun. Like, I, I didn't hate it. It was good- it was good times. We, uh, everyone from stream played. There it is. Just about a year, dude. That's sick. That's so crazy. I know. It's gotta be a year like tomorrow or something, you know what I mean? One freaking year, man. That's awesome. Two or three days? Two or three days of what, Mr. Piggles? Alright, those are blooming. The ants are still going crazy. I wish I could speed up time a little bit more. You know what I mean? Like, it, 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 would, it would appear that there is a lot... Oh, so that's how you open up more zones. Okay. Fish? You can get fish? Oh, wow. This is dope. Okay. We're nine days in now. And that's that. Two or three days of what, Mr. Piggles? Oh shit, a dead, a goot. There's a dead, a goody. I bet it was the ocelot. Yo, we got a picture of the ocelot in the wild. I bet the ocelot killed the agouti. Yeah, I don't know you, sir. I don't think it's possible. But look. Agoutis and ocelots can... They can... Co he literally just killed it and went to sleep. I was going to use them as an example of... Agoutis and ocelots coexisting peacefully. But he literally just... Shut up, Xander. He literally just ate the agouti and went to sleep. So, uh... Rip that concept. Damn. Why does the dead Agouti have a hunger index? Why never mind, Mr. Piggles? Talk to me! Talk to me about... Freaking... Uh, Gmod. What day are we on? We're on day 10 now. This is Ocelot territory, baby. The biodome is at 98%. I need more of these. But we're just kind of stuck. I know, the Ocelots are eating them, man. That's a good thing, though. One, two, the ocelots have to live, you know what I mean? And they have to keep the agouti population down. Well, the ocelots just roaming on Ant Island over here. Both of them are. It's shallow water, I suspect. And takes a nap. Before it goes and kills another unsuspecting agouti. A gouty? A goody? I don't know. A goody rhymes with booty. I think that's where we landed on that.
I still don't have enough points to do anything. Like, I could add more ocelots and agoutis and more of the same plants, I guess, right? What I really want, though, is I want one of these new plants. Like, should I just unlock the armadillo? Screw it. Let's just do it. All right. Let's, uh, let's put the armadillo in range of the ants. And they're also in range of the ocelots and everything else. Boom. Armadillos. For mice? Are there mice? Frogs? Tortoises? A coatamundi? A deer? A collared peccary? It looks like a pig. A capybara? A cougar? A jaguar? They do need more stuff in this game. But I do like the idea, it's pretty dope. Let's drop some uh, shrooms in there for Xander. Hashtag for Xander. Let's put the shrooms on the island of misfit plebs. There we go. Do your thing, armadillos. Yo, all right. We're doing it big. I wish I could unlock more plants, but I can't. Okay, I can get a zebra plant. Let's do it. Just to get more diversity. Screw it. Zebra plants. There's just a, an outcropping of zebra plants right over here. As far as, like, design goes, I'm pretty bad at this game. There we go. No, man. It, there might be mice in, uh... Remember, we're in the rainforest. Look at those little armadillos go. Killing off the ant population. These freaking pleb ants. How are you guys doing? Hungry? What about you guys? Hungry? You should probably eat. There's plenty of food. How are my earthworms? Awesome possum. What about my ocelots? Awesa awesomes. Don't do it, Xander. It's not a good time. Not worth. <laughs> we I wish this thing could jump. I keep hitting spacebar wanting it to jump. You know what I mean? I'd feel a lot better if it could jump. Let's throw some more ants down on Ant Island. This is just like a crazy explosion of ants. They all got stuck on this island. And, uh... And they can't get off because of the, uh... Are they 12th? Y'all, yeah, check them out later, man. I'm glad you're doing your YouTube again. I know that they they also eat leaves though. Like they're doing their thing. I just I I I have to get my I have to get more things going on before I can give them fruit. Cancel. <laughs> Stay away from up in the ante. Yo, it's Ant Island. All these ants, they got caught here and they just keep making new hills. Like like whenever the ants have babies, they then make new ant hills. So like all and now they're fighting for territory. Like uh these two got in a feud and these guys tried to stay neutral, but an ant missile accidentally got launched from these guys blame it on these guys and these guys blame it on these guys nobody knows where the missile came from but it hit these guys up here 
So now they've been drawn into the battle. It's a three-way battle for supremacy next season on Ant Island. New reality TV show. And uh, the Armadillos, uh, they play a part because they're killing everybody. But the ants, the thing is, some of the more revolutionary ants think that the ants need to get together to uh, fight against the Armadillos. But... The problem is, is most of the old school ant leaders who are still in charge decide that they need to fight against the each other. They just can't get it together. But um, there are some lead characters like Ant Mason and Ant Crabtree who are leading the resistance to fight against the armadillos yo thanks 12th i know man i, I i'm a i'm a fan of the grind there are a lot of good streamers on the grind and last night man flame hopper showed up that was so dope the moths are doing a really good job of pollinating. Upping the you are so you are like the worst, Gfro. Legit. How I haven't heard that before. They're talking to me now. What about the ocelots? Do they talk? Where are my os? Are they alive? There they are. The ocelots don't talk. They just quietly kill shit, but sometimes. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Sometimes. And a goody will talk to you. These freaking. These plebs. I literally, I have zero points. My biodome HP is 100%. And I'm just sitting at zero points. Like, what do I do to get points in this game? I know, Prudhomme. That's, ba that's his MO. You didn't do anything, Gfro. You're fine. That's what you did. Stop scaring the agoutis, Gfro. Are you playing RuneScape? I'm on to you, buddy. Wait, I have a fish population? What? Oh, it's at zero. How do I replenish the fish? It's not letting me. Wait. I'd like to, re I've got a hundred whatever. Who the hell knows? Apparently, animals reproduce like crazy. Yeah, it's just, it won't let me reproduce my fish. How did a mushroom get over here? Herbivores eat these. They were over here. Oh, I guess they just pop up. All over the... What is this armadillo doing? Alright, I got ten coins. Okay. I need a lot more than 10 coins. Like this this game is so slow, yo. If this game was faster, I'd be so happy with life. Like if I could speed it up just a little bit more. Because for right now, I can't afford anything. I can afford millipedes. But I don't need any millipedes because I have earthworms and I have mushrooms. So it's like... Like, what do we do? Put some armadillos in the river? Maybe make a couple more ocelots. 
over here. I don't know. I don't know what else to do. I was really excited for this game. But it's so slow. I want to buy coins. But that's all I can do. I can't go I can't go the other way. I can't go the other way around. They 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 sit here and act like impact points are the things that you need. But I'm almost always at a full amount of impact points. I need the coins, yo. How in the hell do you act get coins? Place 10 earthworm territory. Oh. I think we got it. I think we found it. Okay, I have to place 10 earthworm territories. Okay. Easy. One. Or no, it's two. Oh, wait, no, I didn't get it. That's two. Oh, wait, no, I did. Three. Four. See, now we have to wait for this to build up. We found something. We're gonna be earthworm freaking land. Just earthworms everywhere. There will never be an excess amount of poop here. Ever. More earthworms. Because we have millions of freaking earthworms in our little biodome. We need 30. That's gonna put us up to where we can finally get some fruit. But I don't even know if I want fruit anymore. Like, like I feel like I should spend it on something crazy like, uh, like a deer. I should probably spend it on the fruit trees, though. Like a pineapple or a papaya. If I can get a papaya... Actually, the figs look pretty dope, too. Like, the figs look about equal to the papaya. And the papaya is kind of like a tree, isn't it? So I don't know if the little agoutis would be even be able to eat it. We're going for figs. Figs is the next thing we want. We just have to keep pl placing earthworms. Can you guys even hear the music? It looks really low. I don't think you can. I mean, it's really low in my ears, too, but... It's just like this really chill piano. Damn it, you, sir. It's true, man. I... I... <sighs> right after I said it, too, I knew. I was like, ah, oh, mistakes. Mistakes were made. I gotta just bite my tongue sometimes, you know what I'm saying? The mushroom population has been reduced, probably by these crazy-ass armadillos. The ants are actually doing fine. Like, that whole war I was talking about earlier, it's nonsense. There's so many dead agoutis. Oh boy, hiccups. Herbivores eat these. Do they really, you sir? I have never heard that before. As papaya? Seriously? I've never heard that before. That's funny. Alright, we did it. We got... Oh, it gave me 20... It only gave me 5 coins? I thought it was giving me 20 of the things.
No, five coins. Shit. That's ten, five, ten, ten. All of these are not started. It's like, maintain your biodome for 200 years? Who has time for that? We're literally on day 27. Oh my gosh. How do you get more coins? Gaben, please. Hey, we got more coins. We're up to 27. We can get the fig. Okay, cool. We can get the fig. But now we're freaking out of coins again. Holy shit, that's a big tree. Boom. Wow. That thing is not messing around. Place. This is actually kind of dope now. Now that I've got trees in the mix, I'm actually a little excited. It's starting to like, things are starting to pick up. It's starting to look more rainforesty. You know what I mean? It's starting to look a lot more rainforesty. I still wish I could speed up time. That bums me out, but. But we've got a rainforest, ladies and gentlemen. I know, right, Spot? Except not really. It's still... It's still a very slow game. <laughs> I just like the fact that they're trees now. Whee! Well. This is like one of those games that you play when you're like, this is like clicker heroes or some shit. You know what I'm saying? It's one of those games that you just play when like you're not doing anything else. Like if you just want to zone out. Then, uh, then this is one of those games. Because there's just not a whole lot to do. If you could speed up time more, then you'd really be cooking with, like, gas or whatever, you know? But since you can't speed up time, a lot of the time... Playing is just driving around. A group of armadillos have low health? Wait, what? No, they don't. Right? A group of armadillos has low health. What the shit? Average health, average health is 100%. Average hunger is 85%. Where are the armadillos? These guys are fine. You know what? I bet they just got killed by an ocelot or something and that's all it was. I bet that's what happened. 
There's only one of them left from this tribe. There's only one of them left from here, too. Let's throw down some more uh, armadillos, because why the hell not? I just feel like the ocelots are eating all of the armadillos, and that's just what the problem is. And there's nothing we can do about that. Because ocelots are awesome. There's one right now. He's just being awesome. Ocelots are the king of my jungle. <laughs> I think I've got an X game it. I think it's about that time. This is absurd. What up, little armadillo guy? What are you doing so far away from the ants? You should be up here like this guy. Just chilling, eating ants. I gave you an entire map island. Yeah, there's there's nothing else I can do right now. We've gone for a month. One month is good. Wait for something to have babies. 139 days until reproduction. What about you guys? When are you going to have babies? 747 days until reproduction. 368 days until reproduction. 738 days. 330, yeah, like... I'm dying. All right, next game. GG. That was, uh... That was fun. Taito Ecology. It's just so slow. It's just so slow. I wish you could speed it up, but you can't. It's brutal. Oh, like it would be so much fun if it was more like The Sims like or something, if you could just speed it up.